So both of you are so experienced in the entertainment industry. What advice would you give to teens wanting to find their voice? Teens? Man, they need to keep me away from <laughs> from teens. Uh, you go ahead. I didn't even think about that. Oh, man. Um, I think, you know, for me, I've learned that it really is just about um, – finding what is unique about you and and really focusing on that and so I think that's what makes you a great artist you know is to figure out what that thing is that sets you apart and and to yeah yeah <laughs> you like that teens are intimidating aren't they they are I don't like, I don't know about teens no I'm just kidding teens getting in the music industry you mean <laughs> or just teens in general teens in general trying to find their own oh their man own voice. you know what I, I kind of I went on I don't know why well I know why but I'm tell you but i went on a twitter rampage today about for for teens to try to you know just kind of figure things out on their own read and learn as much as they can and when they watch the news be sure they watch all the news channels and because everybody has an agenda and a and an affiliation of some sort and just try to take it every bit of it you can in and and figure stuff out for yourself you know and don't rely on people to just tell you how it is you you figure out how it is, and and then I started drinking again. And, so. You've won The Voice numerous times. What tricks do you have up your sleeve that we haven't already seen? What are the secrets that you hold? Cheating. <laughs> that's that's one of the, my favorite things. Uh, if you ask Adam, he, he swears that I, that I cheat. And Carson. And Carson yeah, believes. He, that, he uh, said you, you uh, manufacture all the votes. Yeah, but Carson's a producer, which shows you how disconnected he is with his job. But... <laughs> Uh, you know what, I, I think that the, the only trick that I have is, is to just get out of the way, you know. I think one of the things, and I've seen it so many times with, with people on this show where they'll get some momentum going and they'll be making their point and, and get some fans. And then they'll take a, a left turn and, and, and think for some, for some strange reason on this show, people think that they need to always like show a completely different side of who they are and I don't know artists that do that in in the real world in the real music industry I mean I don't I don't imagine uh, you know Madonna's going to do a, a George Jones song just to show that she can do it someday she's going to do what she does you know and so I try to keep artists on the path that they want to be on you know and, and that way they feel comfortable and and they feel creative that way you know and not lost and, and, and overwhelmed. Well, Megan, what are some of your favorite moments that you've had with Blake that we haven't seen on the television show? Oh, man. Um, or funniest. Funniest. Or drunkest. Drunkest? Oof. Or highest. Or highest. I wasn't going to go there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, he just um, keeps pushing it, so go along. No, you yeah. Do you have a good answer for this? I feel like... Well, you know what? They don't... Man, there's very few times there's not a... Just like right now, there's not a camera in our, in our, in our face, face yeah. whenever we're together. So we haven't had, uh, back in the day, we, we hung out some, but we ain't had a lot of time just to hang out. And and we will, and you'll read about it in the papers <laughs> one of these days. So how about that? Last question. How's your coaching style now that you're just down to, to one? Uh, it's just stand back and, and let her shine. You know, I think the best thing you can do with, with someone like Megan is – just give her her space and let her have her moment and and support her and if there's something going on in a song that's that you kind of go well maybe you ought to think about that but usually you, there's not even that with with megan it's just she's got good instincts she knows what she's wanting to do and who she is and the best thing i can do is just acknowledge that and and, and let her have that freedom in that moment you know yeah. thank you blake mm -hmm. thank you so much thanks and guys Yes. Come on. Hashtag Team Blake. Thank you. Good to see you, girls.